Good evening, and thank you for joining us as we celebrate Lights Up in the City of Fort Saskatchewan. So this year, we have to do things just a little bit differently, but we're still happy to offer Lights Up in our community for this Christmas season. Christmas really is such a wonderful time of the year. It gives us a chance to look forward to family and friends, having some fun, and of course, the new year. It's usually a time to reflect on the year gone by. And if I can, I would encourage you to remember the positives because that is what will keep you with the spirit of Christmas. And speaking of positives, this year, the City of Fort Saskatchewan has partnered up with Dow Canada to have a Light Up Your Home contest. We're encouraging our residents to post pictures of their decorated and lit up homes on the Fort Saskatchewan Facebook or Instagram and tag the City of Fort Saskatchewan and Dow Canada. Winners will have an opportunity to win a holiday gift basket valued at $100. And of course, there may always be some extra prizes thrown in. I'm told that we will even deliver this personally to your door by myself and Dow Canada. So for more information, visit our city webpage, www.fortsas.ca slash lights up. This year, more than ever, I'm just reaching out to our residents to say we need to keep the spirit of Christmas alive and celebrate our traditions. So without further ado, I'm going to continue our tradition that we do at Lights Up. And I'm going to be reading our Twas the Night Before Christmas, and then we'll have the countdown to our wonderful Lights Up. And I always enjoy this part so much, reading Twas the Night Before Christmas. Twas the night before Christmas, when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, in hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled, all snug in their beds, while visions of sugar plums danced in their heads. And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap had just settled down for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from the bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash, tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave luster to midday of objects below. When what to my wondering eyes should appear but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick, I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid than eagles, his concourse they came, and he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen, to the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As the dry leaves before the wild hurricanes fly, when they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up on the housetop, the concourse they flew, with the sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof the prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my hand and I was turning around, down the chimney, St. Nicholas, he came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished. They were covered in ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler opening his pack. 
His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples, how merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His drool little mouth was drawn like a bow, and his beard of his chin was white as the snow. The stump of his pipe he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. His ha he had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. His, he was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf, and I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but he went straight to work and he fi filled each of the stockings and turned with a jerk. And laying his finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney, he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his, steam, to his team gave a whistle, and away they flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim, ere he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all, and to all a good night. So I hope you enjoyed that. And now we will do the countdown, and I will push this very beautiful, wonderful magic switch. So join me in the countdown. You're watching this. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, lights up! <laughs> so Merry Christmas to all. And remember, keep the spirit of Christmas alive and join us and Dow Canada in our photo contest. Thank you. Have a wonderful Christmas. Be kind to one another. Merry Christmas to all. <laughs>